hey guys welcome back to another video here at creators theory in today's video we'll see how to create a loop video effect in filmora but before starting this tutorial if you don't have the latest version of filmora then make sure you download it from the link in the description below and in the upcoming video we'll see how to create a loop animation video in filmora so if you want to get notified about the video or other similar videos related to filmora then make sure you hit the subscribe button and follow for more filmora related tutorials so let's get started with the tutorial as you can see i've already imported all the media in the bin so i have three different videos in which i will show you how to create a loop effect so first is the one you saw in the intro is this video of a girl jumping into the pool so i have this complete video and as you can see see she jumps over here so for creating a loop what i will do i will right click on it and i will copy this video or just Control c and go at the last frame and paste this paste this video again now what i will do i will right click on it once again go into speed and durations and here click on reverse speed and click on ok and again we will paste the similar video so that it close with the flow now if i play this video and have a look as you can see the reverse effect happens so if you want to continue this loop you can go on pasting again in the similar fashion so again we will paste another video and we will reverse this one in the similar way so this loop keeps on going so this is one way of creating uh, one style of creating a loop effect and here let me bring another video so sometimes what we will happen that entire video will not be suitable for the loop effect as you can see uh, this complete video uh, uh, over here so what i will do uh, in this video i want the loop effect till here so what i will do i will cut this video short and then i will copy this go ahead copy and then paste it again and then i can right click go and speed and duration and click on reverse click on ok and then again paste the similar video so now if you see this effect it will look something like this and uh, so that was the simple in this i have edited the part of the video and selected only that part for which i want the loop effect to happen so the last and the final part is uh, maybe a time lapse type of thing where i have a steady video of one place and there are there is not much motion so the user will not really be able to detect if there is any motion happening in this video so what i will do i will just again copy or i can just go control c and i will go at the last frame control v control v control v so even if you go on keep on playing this from one video to another there will be not much change visible in this video so this is one but still there as you can see there is a light uh, slight change so as you can see that jerk action so what we can do for that action i will just expand this a little bit bring it back over here i will go into transaction transitions and here i will bring the dissolve effect i will just reduce it a little bit and if you see it now you can see a slight uh, blur type of happening so this will keep this keep this loop churning around and so you can increase and reduce the size of this transition and as you can see it tries to smooth the action a little bit so that's it guys with the simple loop video effect in filmora in the upcoming video and we will see how to create a loop animation in filmora if you want to get notified then make sure you hit the subscribe button and if you like this video then make sure you hit the like button so that's it guys from my side see you guys in another video till then see ya